There we go. There we go. All right. Go crazy. I'm here with Ariel and Kevin. Say hi. 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 We lost our video. Oh, there we go. Hey. And uh, we're here in the uh, community lounge of I.O. I'll just show you. Here we have a guy from Italy speaking. Here we have Japan. Oh, Chris cool. Van. And uh, calling in to GDGs and uh, I extended events all over the world. Oh, great. We, we were talking to uh, Kenya early, earlier today. We, we wanted oh, to add them to our cool. keynote, but we could. We just, you know, we had a side chat with them. <laughs> very nice. And uh, do we have uh, Virginia Peak on the line as well? Yes, Bart. This is uh, G. G. Hampton Rhodes. Hampton Rhodes, cool. Hey, Hampton Rhodes. Hey, Hampton Rhodes. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. So, I'm Martin. This is Oriel. Oriel, this is. And this is uh, Kevin. So, uh, uh, what were some of the big things that stood out to you in the keynote that you that excited you guys? Wearable. We're here in wearable. We're here in wearables for sure. I'm sorry. Were you repeating that time? Oh, we're, we're, wearables. Wearables. Yes. If anybody wants to ask, we can line up over here and you can. Uh, in uh, in uh, July or August or September. Oh, Are there okay. any questions uh, related to the keynote from uh, the Rhodes or New Jersey? Yeah. Oh, Hi, I wanted. Can you hear me okay? Uh, I wanted. There are many people around me here. I wanted to know more about the um, containerization features for Android for the business case, uh, the MDM. Is that going to only be in the L release? And also, um, will that be an app or will that be like Samsung's Knox, where it's just enabling AirWatch and other MDMs to take advantage of new features? I heard the entire question, except the right at the beginning. You said the something features. The, <laughs> yeah, the. Um, the containerization features, is that uh, for the business security where we're going to be able to uh, differentiate between work and play for end users, um, containerize their applications, their uh, business work documents? Uh, are you talking about containerization yes. in Chromebooks? Uh, they were showing that on the, the L platform, on the, the Android platform of being able to um, again, have a separate um, identity. identity for work, a separate identity, uh, kind of like the AirWatch today, other MDM security where I can, you know, delete but not delete the entire phone. Got it. Okay. I finally understood your question. That's a great question. I don't know the answer. Let's have an Oreo now. One moment. <laughs> we can we can make up the time here and there. Peace out. Thank you. Does that answer your question? Yeah, I wanted to know if it was just the L release or if it would be an app, you know, kind of like the current mobile security um, for older versions. Thank you. Yes. Um, Thanks, good question. I'd like to know more about the health API, much like I have a, a Fitbit, Fitbit, you know, like how to integrate those things into your or things like that integrated into the, your uh, into an app. So, health 
Uh, could you the, the, the health API, can you do things with like a Fitbit or what, what's, what will be available and how will that integrate? Uh, I can put to you on the health API. And, and then just like... Um, no, okay. Well, okay. Figured I'd ask. <laughs> For that, uh, the, the place to go for that is the developers.google.com. Questions about the Fitbit. And and other APIs, yeah. Yeah. And the other, the general, it, there wasn't much on the uh, health API. It was just more. Yeah, so I've tried to wear watches for, for several weeks now. And uh, the stuff that, that I've played with, uh, it's got built-in heart rate monitor. Okay. Um, built-in step counter, which is very, very similar to Fitbit. Okay. Uh, I'm actually not allowed to show it until tomorrow. Oh. Uh, but tomorrow, <laughs> I'll show you some pictures of, of my watch. I've had for quite a while. I've been working with parts on it. Uh, they're really nice. It's really clear. Uh, but it's like the fitness stuff I've seen has been heart rate monitor. Uh, I've actually got the uh, Samsung watch. Okay, so they'll they'll be an equivalent. Yeah, yeah. Okay. They're 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 equivalent to Fitbit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I put my vote. Okay, thank you. Go right, one more. Google Plus turns three on Saturday, and I was a little surprised that we didn't hear about Google Plus and, and Google Glass. Is there any, I know you can't tell us what's coming, but is there anything, anything you can tell us about updates or what to expect with Google Plus and Google Glass? Ooh, you know, I don't know. I think if they had anything in the works, it would have been announced today. Yeah. But, uh, so I'm not aware of any huge, I mean, they're doing a lot of stuff with the, uh, the, you know, the fluid design stuff and a lot of reworks and changes there. Uh, I noticed there's also a lot of work uh, going into doing adding CAS support uh, uh, for making CAS support as well. Uh, so like your photos and things like that, you can cast them up uh, in your living room and show those to your family. Uh, those are some of the things I know that recently have been uh, All that right. have been working on. Thank you. Did you have a Hey guys. Oh wait, hold on a second. Okay. Sorry, we know, we know we're dominating here. Um. <laughs> hey, I just want to mention something else about the wear. Uh, Tor and Ken, uh, if you are running uh, wear uh, programming events uh, uh, in uh, your respective GDGs, I'd be happy to pitch in a sponsor prize sending uh, Android Wear device to the winner. Just so you know, email me and we can set up those events later. Awesome. We're in. We're in. Hey guys, just one question I have that everything seems to revolve around the phone now, that everything that everything is an extension of the phone, all the screens, even if it's my watch or my television or my car, everything is revolving around my phone. So what are you guys doing to secure it? That if my phone is lost, could someone else drive my car? <laughs> <laughs> or control my television, change my channels. So what are you guys looking at doing for that, securing the whole platform? So uh, I, mean, I heard much of the question, uh, something about the internet, what's going on your phone, something about it. Uh, I'll slow down. down. Uh, well, actually, everything is revolving around the phone now. That uh, the watch, the television, Chromecast, everything is extension of my phone. So if my phone is lost, or let's say someone else, or Todd gets, uh, gets my phone somehow, uh, he will get full control of my television, my car, and maybe other things. Yeah, welcome to the connected world. So something has to be done to secure it, guys, right? What happens is actually this this happened to me recently. My I give my old my old phones to my daughter, and she's only eight years old. So she keeps losing them. And uh, what happens then is we just if you turn on that uh, secure uh, shoot, I forget what it's called now, but it's this service you can turn on. Okay. Of Android now, so that whenever she loses her phone, we where it was last time, we see it, if it's activated again, and we can remote, remote flight call. Yeah. All right. When my daughter loses hers. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Good question. <laughs> so there was a question about... Uh, um, GDG laptop. <laughs> GDG, yay. So going up here by going to be available for testing. Uh, that's a great question. Uh, I don't know, but the place to watch is uh, um, Google Developers Google Plus account and developers.google.com. It will be up there when it's available. Any other questions or, or comments uh, about the <laughs> Oh, yeah, we're not purified as well testing. I don't know. Yeah. So the, the place to check is developers the Google.com and the Google developers um, community 
on Google Plus. Uh, and uh, as soon as there are updates, they will be there. Um, it looks pretty cool, I'm purified, isn't it? I will use it for my apps. Hey, hey, Martin. Uh, is there any way we could see like the conference floor? Can you sh can you show like a little tour? Is that possible? Or are you stuck yeah. there? Uh, let's see. Uh, well, I can show you. Uh, so I have a wired connection here because there's, it's electromagnetic mayhem here uh, on the wireless. It's like, uh, but I can show you a bit of the uh, lounge here. So here's the community lounge. And then. And uh, so this is outside the main sessions. Yeah, but. Uh, hey, Brandy, wave to you guys in New Jersey. <laughs> So that's as far as my table will take me. Um, and if I disconnect, then I'll be fighting over everybody with everybody else over on the wireless here. All right. Uh, so thanks for joining us. Uh, any other comments or questions uh, before we hang up while I see if I can hear you? Can you ask about YouTube for me? Is there anything YouTube? What about it? If there's anything coming up for me. Any, anything uh, crazy coming up with YouTube? We have one last question. YouTube APIs, I guess, or whatever. Music. Or uh, music. Oh, yeah. oh. oh. Right, where are we going with that? One moment. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. 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 Yeah. A anything coming to YouTube? Uh, anything happening to YouTube? Let me, let me think for a minute. Uh, not, not particularly that, that, that I can think of anything super uh, relevant in the YouTube world. I know Oreo who's here with us uh, just did the, the cast V2 integration for Play Movie. Uh, he just did the iOS integration there. Uh, you should see that any day, which has a few of the features there, but for YouTube, I'm not aware of anything. Uh, sorry. As far as far as with Polymer, are is there going to be a lot of um, the basic SDKs built into kind of Polymer type components? Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of push for the web component stuff, and I think a lot of the fluid stuff. Uh, there's a lot of people who are interested in through uh, Polymer. So, um, a lot of support for that. The uh, two are integrated very, very well. So, I think you're going to see a shift um, from Angular more in the Polymer direction. Okay, thank you. Cool. Well, I think uh, we're about out of time. We've got to get this hard uh, wire jack uh, over to the next group. But I'll, I'll hand this off to Mark and let him close things out. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, the sessions? We pushed them back by a little bit. We just started at like 310. Yeah, we're, we're good. We're good. Thanks.